You need to know everything you can about that load before you pick it. The big questions are, how much does it weigh, where is its center of gravity, and how can it be picked up so that it isn't damaged? Obviously, you need to know the weight so that you don't exceed the capacity of your lifting devices. If you don't know the weight, ask somebody who does, or use a handbook like this one to help you calculate the weight. The center of gravity question is important because it plays a big role in how you rig an object. The center of gravity is the point at which the load is balanced. This is where the horizontal and vertical balance points intersect. In most cases, you want the attachment device to be above the CG, or center of gravity, because you want the object to hang the same way it's sitting on the ground or on the trailer. Lifting something from a point below the CG is a sure way to flip that object over in a hurry. When lifting an odd shape load, the CG will be difficult to determine. For these kinds of loads, attach two legs of equal length and then attach a third leg that's adjustable. Adjust this third leg through experimentation until the load is level. Lifting a load that is not level will result in one leg carrying a much larger load than the other legs of the sling. You can snap a perfectly good sling and cause an accident by not lifting level. Anything that could be damaged by the lifting action should be padded or supported. 